bunch of junk lines set out. It's just beautiful down here. Right on. Here we go. show y'all something about making these jug lines here. I think put your string on here. That's what I'll do first. Well first I take take get your Gatorade jug or Power Aid, whatever they are. I rinse them out, let them dry in the sun, get some spray paint, just whatever cheap spray paint you can find. Spray it up in there. Uh then take and tie that string around that lip right there. See the lip? You always want to get behind that lip. I'll show you why in a minute. Now, I also take these things. A lot of time I don't paint them. Uh, uh, I'll take them and uh, just take them clear ones. And I go to a Dollar Tree or one of them stores like that. You get them uh, glow sticks. And I make me up about 20 or 30 of them like that clear and take the grandkids in the boat and put them glow sticks in them and tie them up and just throw them out. And we have a ball just chasing the, chasing the glow sticks around with the catfish on them at night. But let me show you how to tie this. When you get your string, get you some of these little sinkers. It don't matter what kind. Uh, a lot of times you can use uh, nuts, uh, boats, anything you tie on there with a little bit of weight. All you need is a little bit to sink that, sink that bait. Watch this here. You tie this. And we're trying to get off on the cheap. You know, this is cheap, so if you lose one, you're going to lose one or two. You know, uh, tie that sinker on there like that, okay? Then you come and double that line. See, like that? A little, little bit hang off right there. Tie your knot, right here. Just like that. Boop, done. Done deal, see how that is? Now watch this. Get your fish hook right here. Can y'all see it? The line you tie, the end you tie, you take that fish hook and do this. Run it through there, Boop. Over through that. It's on there, see it? Just tie that sinker right there. Okay. Couple knots right there, make sure it holds. Then you take the string right here and you kind of you kind of double it. Can y'all see that? Double that thing. Tie your knot. Now, I know a lot of people use swivels and all that. You don't need all that mess. There you go. So once you got that knot tied like that, now you watch what I'm telling you. You take the end of it, you come down like this. You run it through here. I get to I always get, I use about a six alt hook. That's a big hook now for catfish. But I like to catch big catfish. See how I'm doing that? You run it through there, take that loop, run it right there. Two, bam, she's done. See, see how it do it? Now that, that sinker will sit there on the bottom and this hook just drifts just back, like back and forth like that. And that big catfish gonna come get it. But then you take, you take this jug, I'll show you this. You wind it up. Wind and wind and wind. Depends what how deep you know you want them. I, I, different different rivers I fish in, I go different depths. So you drop that in here, just like that. Drop it in. You're done with it. Uh, screw that lid on it. You don't have to worry about it. Uh, you throw it in a bucket or sack or something like that. You don't have to worry about the hit hook getting caught in nothing. Uh, and you just, it's nothing to it. You know, once you do that, then I, I throw them in my, in my bucket with the rest of them, you see? And, uh, and see how this is? Then you can throw that in a, in a bucket or a sack or whatever, and it just, the hook ain't clogged up, you know? And uh, when you get ready, all you do, you like that, shake it out, too. You bait that hook, put your cap back on it, throw it. Once you throw it, you let it an hour or two, just whatever you feel like it. Come back later and check it. Hopefully you have a look like we do, catch some good catfish. Get you something. And, uh, just a good way to fish. It's easy. Uh, if you got kids, it's especially fun with the kids. You know, we ride around, throw these chugs out. Uh, just let them run around. And, you know, it, it's, just, it's just fun with the kids. It teaches them how to fish, catch them something to eat.
think they got him. This is it. They got a big one on this one here. Cut this off and drift up to him. Let me see if we can get some pride. My wraps are good. Going in the boat. What y'all talking about that? That's a good one. Hey! I know we come back and get him this morning. Hey! Let me get this hook out. Got a couple of these hooks still in these. That's that first one I caught a while ago. I think we're going to have a fish fry, huh? One out. That's a big fish on it. I'm excited. The main reason I'm excited is because I don't think this is the line that actually has a fish. So, that tells me I might have another big one up here. That was last night, but I kind of think... That's the one me and Miss Janet lost last night. I come back and got him. I think that's him. Who'd have fun? <laughs> 